Hello, hi. I am Stephen Samuel, your official IELTS examiner. Uh, my examination code is 2345. And as per records, you are Asher Pisan. Okay, your candidate login is 2394. Okay, okay, Asher, for the examination purpose, I am going to record the entire section. Okay, what is your name? Well, my name is Asher Puduparambil Sami. How may I address you, Asher? You may address me, Asher. Where are you from? Well, I am from Patanandita, which is famous with this pilgrim and uh, well-known Shabirimala, which is situated by nearby my hometown. Are you a student or are you working? Well, by profession, I am a civil engineer and uh, I have one year of experience in Saudi Arabia and I am um, pursuing for having my master's from Germany. Why Germany, Asher? Because India is famous for education as well as rituals and tradition. Then why you opt Germany instead of India? Well, India is a better country for education. Well, uh, but uh, Germany provides more than India that uh, the facilities and Germany is a developed country. But when, the, when we compare with India, it is a developing country. So I would like to have a job or, or have education or further job in Germany in a developed country. Okay, Asher, we will move towards the intro section, okay, or part one section. Uh, I will ask you some personal question as well as something related to uh, current affairs, okay. Uh, do you cook, Asher? Well, I cook uh, because from my childhood I like to cook because uh, my mother always uh, liked to teach me how to cook and uh, which still I have an eager to know more about that which will I definitely think it will help me in my future. How often do you cook a share? Well, uh, mostly I like to cook during weekends because uh, the balance days I am very swamped with my works as well as my studies. So I only have time to cook during my weekends. So you are a working person, am I right? Yeah. Okay. Did you cook when you were a child? Well, if my memory serves me correct, uh, I does not cook, uh, do not cook during my childhood because I am not that much aware of cooking. But I have, I had helped my mother uh, when was uh, when I was a kid. So you are a philanthropic person. You helped your mother. Am I right? Yes. Okay. What is better, cooking or serving, from your perspective? Well, in my perspective, it depends. When I am with friends, I like to cook. Well, whereas when I am with my family, I mostly like to serve food. Okay, Asher. Uh, how cooking skill changed over time? Well, in the ancient time, people have cooked within their facilities and available of the, uh, the agricultural items which they have provided in within their society. But in the present, they have, we can grab many of kind varieties of uh, food items from within from international level, which is provided by supermarkets. Well. In the future, I think it will be provided more than what we have seen, see, because uh, uh, mostly cooking are mostly uh, new kind of uh, cooking style are provided by m many social medias like YouTube and Instagrams, which they always like to issue new kind of uh, cooking skills and style, which people are more eager to do that. Okay, Asher. After reaching your favorite tour destination, I think. Uh, you have a dream country in your mind. So after reaching that dream country, will you prefer to cook? Yeah, of course. I like to cook whenever, with, uh, with any any stages. Uh, if I reach my destination place, even though I like to uh, cook uh, very well, uh, because I always like to have uh, a food which I have prepared by with myself. So I will definitely cook if if I reach my destination. Okay, share. India is famous for automation. Yeah, now there is a trend uh, of automatic vehicles. Or oh, in future, will you use uh, a automatic vehicle or electric vehicle or a petrol or diesel vehicle? Well, uh, in the future, I will definitely opt for uh, automatic vehicle because I think it will definitely uh, 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 reduce the human effort of driving, which I think it is easy to or handle for many kind of people uh, in my society. Okay, sure. I am very happy to speak with you, for, but there is a time limit, so we will move towards the part two, uh, cue card section. You have one minute preparation time. Uh, after the preparation time, you can start speaking. Okay, this is your cue card. You can prepare now.
Okay, your time starts now. Okay, your time has ended. You can start speak now. Well, my favorite sports is badminton because from my childhood I like to play badminton because my father is a badminton player. So he, during my childhood, he teach me how to play badminton. But he doesn't know that new techniques and skill to improve my skill. So. When I reached during my college days, I got a best friend called Ashish Vargis who know more about badminton because he, during his childhood, he go for a coaching in his nearby his hometown. So, uh, well, during the, my college days, he teach me the new techniques and the skills uh, what he have learned during his childhood, and uh, which helped me more to achieve. And I have achieved. I had achieved. Uh, first prize in badminton during my uh, academic days and which I this is still in my remember and which make me uh, feel over the moon on the, those days and uh, I each and every day I play uh, badminton because I think it robs my health if we involve in an sports because each and every part of our body is uh, it's involved in badminton uh, so I always like to play badminton and there is an uh, outdoor place which uh, our society provide uh, who have people who have enthusiasm in badminton so I usually use that and explore that kind of opportunity and each and every day I play in that and you can wind up a share and this is my favorite sports I usually play would like to play now and in future okay sir sure, kindly hand over your cue card okay share we will move towards the uh, follow-up section. This is the part three section. Okay, what type of sports are popular in your country? Why? Well, uh, the popular sports are outdoor sports like uh, football and uh, cricket, which is more popular in my hometown uh, because uh, people are more enthusiastic about cricket, mostly about cricket and football. Uh, so, which their people think it will definitely uh, help to robust their health as well as their mind, which some people also think that it will definitely regenerate their mood. So, from your conversation, your hometown is famous for outdoor activities, am I right? Yes. So, how often do you play a sport? Why? Well, each and every day I play uh, sports because uh, my, there are more, uh, many friends nearby. My there are many friends in my neighborhood who have an enthusiasm in playing. So they always invite me for going for an outdoor activities to play badminton as well as football. So uh, I like to, which I think I have uh, come from, from and, and developed my health from that. Yeah. From your conversation, I found that you are an enthusiastic person. Yeah. So, what are the benefits of playing a sport from your perspective? Well, in my perspective, there are a plethora of uh, benefits which provide by sports. Mainly, people who have who is obese, uh, it definitely helps to reduce that, which I think it will definitely help to reduce and make in a perfect fit body to for their further uh, for further movement without uh, causing any diseases or any kind of <coughs> health issues and also it definitely uh, build our mind or build our confidence for more uh, because for the further moments if we have uh, involved in a situation which cannot be handled is this kind of if people are involved this, uh, in sports it definitely help to face that kind of issues with the confidence they okay, gain. Okay, share. Uh, section has ended, you can go now share. I am wishing you best of luck for your future. Okay.